very early. I'd give him a spanking, but he did a this day only that we have only one more sh a show after this with which you can take advantage of it. Mike's gonna give you all those details, um, but because I always defer to the experts, uh, we do have a couple of things in this show. And Mike, I don't know if you're there or not to give us just kind of a little preemptive um, introduction to, uh, to a couple of the goodies we have coming up. So this is the S Mint and the W Mint. Now, by the way, this is from last hour. So Mike, this comes in the big green box. You have to have that chain of command. It's ultra specific. It, it's all of that stuff. I hope we make some time for this in this hour. I, I mean, I think this is a spectacular. We just, we literally got this in the show, you know, an hour before the show. Because what happens is, is we thought that the United States government, all right, you know, they're going to make the 2021, uh, uh, they're going to make it, we only thought they were going to make it at West Point Mint, they had to cancel the proof coin, it would be the only coin available. But literally a couple days ago, we found out that there would be a very tiny sliver of, you know, San Francisco Mint helping out emergency strike, emergency production as best they could to help out. Now it's going to be exponential rarer than the West Point minted coin, but we got a few of them, folks. And we have the two coin set. So this is the 2021, the Type 1. Remember, only to be made for six months. Now, the West Point mint will be released for six months. The San Francisco minted coin, one tranche at the beginning of the year, I believe already sold out from all the authorized purchases. Forget about all the certification. A match-numbered Mint State 70 pair. Match-numbered Mint State 70 pair. Only 2,000 and 21 match numbered sets. I think we've probably already sold about 300 of those. We have. Somewhere along those lines. We have, Mike. And hey, also, remember, there is an encore, albeit a abbreviated look at our This Day Only, which is also historic. So, Mike, uh, again, broad strokes, today's special sold out. But we are seeing a couple of unique things, well, a lot of unique things from the U.S. Mint. Tell everybody a quick little bullet point about this. Well, like I said, this is our brand new New Year's edition that we have here. So once again, they're doing the two coins. They're doing the type one and they're doing the type two. So I've got my exclusive flag core. And then something that we've been doing for a couple of years, but I'm doing it special this year. This is our New Year's edition. So the core is exclusive, but the New Year's edition, we do one thing. We sell it today and today only. And actually, the last half of the day, it's only about eight hours. Whatever we can sell in eight hours is what we end up with in terms of the addition. I don't know what the addition is. Right now, I think it's about 1,600 or so, which is nothing. The Annex TS, 13,500, I know it'll be rarer than that. We're also going to auto ship that with the Type 2 that's going to be labeled New Year's Edition because you bought it on New Year's, an absolutely unique uh, two coin set. This is available only here on HSN and this day only. Not just by price, but period, this day only. And I think that's a very clear distinction. So unlike other this day onlys, to, like in every respect, today and today only. Okay, Mike, this is going to be fast and furious. So I'm going to turn things over to you immediately, my friend. Well, here's what we got. We got the gold. And we talked about this in the last hours. I saw just about sold out. The four-piece gold sets at $7,500 a piece. These are the component pieces. We have to remember, everybody's talking about, you know, Silver Eagle, Silver Eagle, Silver Eagle, change, 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 change. The Gold Eagle is changing too, folks. The Gold Eagle is changing too. And so what we have with the Gold Eagle, I think more so than the Silver Eagle, is I think a lot of people will uh, kind of wait on their purchases until the uh, Type 2 comes out. And what we may end up with is incredible rarity in the Type 1. Regardless, it is the last of an era, the end of an era. It's a legacy coin, a, a tr you know, a transition coin, whatever it is. So we, here we have 221. 221 on the limited edition is what we're looking at here. I'd like to know how many we have left. I suspect it's under 100. Um, we're, we're pretty close. I had one other airing on this. It traditionally lasts about two airings. And like I said, so it's solid gold. This is the most affordable gold coin that we have here at HSN. It also is the largest edition, laughably, at 221 coins for the very last of the American $5 gold eagles with the Type 1 or the family of eagle design is what we've got on this one. And so this is the end of an era here as well. This is an end of an era here as well. 
And Mike, here's the thing. We do have only about 100 of these. So when I said fast-paced and furious, we're going to, you know, move through these. Uh, it is on 12-month VIP financing. I should point that out. That makes it a little over $37 and change and $37.49 to be a little more precise, thanks to my producer, Steve. So, Mike, that's just it. I think for the educated collector, you've got something for everybody. But just in terms of quantity, this is not for everybody. No. No, I understand that uh, because, uh, well, it is limited. And if you want a gold coin, well, this is the most affordable one. This is the one that you really have to go to. But there in 221, for the very last coin of its entire series, that's a pretty limited edition. Like I said, we're well over half sold through on that. So great, great, great opportunity for you to uh, pick up the last of the American $5 gold eagles with the family of eagle reverse. Okay. And as you said, Mike, in terms of the family of coins or opportunities that we're going to present, that is your most affordable. Affordable opportunity. Yes, 12-month VIP financing and flex pay. Really unique in the industry. So, Mike, I want to make sure I'm doing this right. So, now we're going to talk about the $10, correct? Right, correct. And it's funny, uh, uh, you, you give me more credit. If you turn that coin over, uh, I think you'll see on that why I call it the family of eagles, because there's literally a family of eagles on the back. It's not like I'm being very, you know, <laughs> it's not like I'm being sly. <laughs> I'm calling that. There's literally a family of eagles. The authorizing legislation requires that there be a family of eagles on the original gold eagle. And as you can see, the addition on this, 46 coins. I think we're about half sold through on that, a little over half sold through on the $10 eagle that we're going to have. Once again, all of these first day of issue gold eagles. They're the last coins that will ever be done with the design, the family of eagles design, okay? They're the very last one that's going to be incredibly small limited editions and 100% 100% exclusive to us here at HSN, because as is all Annex first day of issue coins, as are all Annex first day of issue coins, only 46 in the entire edition, like I said, well over half sold through on that, quarter ounce of gold in that, quarter ounce of pure gold is contained within that. <clears throat> and you have to understand that the value on this, look, the quarter ounce of gold is, is pretty valuable in its own right. But understand the numismatic value, the fact that it's first day of issue, the fact that it's Mint State 70, the fact that it is the end of an era, if you will. It's an end of an era because they are changing the design later in 2021. Now, unlike the silver coin, I think people are going to wait a significant time for the gold coins. So I think these might be sleepers, these these early issue 2021 gold coins, uh, because I think people are going to wait, and I think they're going to end up being far rarer than what people think. I think you're right, too. And Mike, at this point, we have only a dozen, give or take. All right, we continue to move along. Uh, now we're talking about the $25, correct? Yes. And, and you know, I, I think part of the issue with this is we're looking at, you know, quantities left on these. I think are important when we have these very, very, very tiny additions uh, within these coins. So the $25 coin is a half ounce, is a half ounce of pure gold is ultimately what it comes down to. There's only 36, only 36 in the entire edition that we're going to have here. I think we have probably two dozen of these left, one or two dozen in the entire edition. It is going to be, and I think that we're going to have a fairly significant, in terms of uh, a rarity on this one, the half ounce tends to be pretty rare. Okay? The half ounce tends to be pretty rare. I'm showing about a dozen of these coins left. I'm showing about a dozen of these. So almost two dozen of these already sold uh, is what we're looking at on this. And so once that goes, because the most popular coin is the $5 coin. In terms of, so they make them to order. So that's the mintage. Most popular coin is the $5 coin. Second most popular is actually the $50 coin, then the $10 coin. And in terms of what people buy, it's the $25 coin. It's the $25 coin, which lends to extreme, extreme rarity, which is also shown in the gold coins, in the single gold coins. This is the lowest edition of only 36. Well, and they are going for sure. And um, as, as, as we're going to get ready, and we're going to show you one more coin in this family of eagles, so to speak. Steve, I think you said 166 and change. 
166.66 on that 12 month VIP financing as well. And Mike, as we get ready to roll along, you know, I remember the day, in fact, I'll let you say the line about the, the customer who said there was something about the weight or the feel of gold. I, I, you don't know how <laughs> yeah. I'm exercising self control yeah, yeah, I know to, exactly. to I know exactly what you're talking about. It was, it. It, was, and it, was, it was 10 or 12, 13 years ago. She had bought a $50 gold coin, a big gold coin like this. And one of the things about this is it's a pure ounce of gold when you do the, uh, when you get the big $50 coin. And so she'd got it and she'd called into the show and was saying how much she liked it. And I said, I asked her, how does it feel? And what I, what I, what I thought she was going to say, what I was trying to have her say was that it was heavy. Okay. Because I mean, your gold is so dense. So I said, how did it feel? And she thought, I said, how does it make her feel? And so instead of answering heavy, she said, oh, it makes me feel rich. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I've remembered that to this day. In honor of that, I believe that was the last phone call I've ever taken on the coin show. I okay? think you're right. <laughs> we were never, ever, ever going to do better than that. Okay? <laughs> it makes me feel rich. I said, okay. We're maxed out. It never gets any better. <laughs> that is so true. In fact, I talk about a segue. We are talking about that $50 gold, my friend. Well, as well, we should. This is the biggest gold coin made by the United States. Because one ounce pure gold uh, uh, contained within this. I think the 25 just sold out or came very close. Um, so here's the $50 coin. The biggest gold coin made by the United States government. I have only 48 in the edition. I think we sold about a dozen, so I got maybe three dozen of these remaining. I really want to focus on the change of design in the gold eagle. Because once again, nobody has focused on that. Nobody has thought about that. Nobody has, has in any way realize the importance of changing the, the design on the gold eagle. This family of eagles that, that, with this uh, male bald eagle coming in, landing in the nest and, and bringing stuff to the nest with a, with a couple of fledglings and then his mate there has always graced the American gold eagle. That's changing. And it is changing dramatically. They literally, quite literally, had to change the authorizing legislation for this particular thing, because the authorizing, original authorizing legislation said that it must be a family of eagles. It must be a family of eagles. And so they had to change it because the new design is a single headshot of an eagle that's really crazy fierce. It's one of, uh, one of going to be one of, end up being one of my favorite coin designs, which is why a lot of people are going to wait till then, <clears throat> which will make this coin could end up making this coin one of the rarest of all the gold eagles ever made by the United States government. I can't make that statement yet. It's a pure guess. It's pure speculation. Well, that's just 25 years of, uh, of coin guessing. <laughs> not your first rodeo. It comes with that. <laughs> not your first barbecue. Not your first rodeo. All right. right. Well, we got to keep things moving here. Uh, and, Mike, we have scooted along. So, now, what is the relevance of this particular $5 gold eagle? This is, just, this is just we do ICG as well. Uh, you know, first day of issue, NGC and ICG are, uh, are our exclusive properties. First day of issue, we always do a few ICG coins. We've been selling them for as long as I've been on the air. And we have people that very loyally collect ICG coins. Only 93 in the limited edition here. So a very, very quick, you know, 30-second look or so is uh, all we've got on this ICG gold coin is, uh, is all that we're looking at here. So again, a very short little presentations because one of the things that we do, and, and Mike, I just wanted to mention this, um, a lot of people well, record these shows, go online and watch these shows after the fact. And it's it's on more than one occasion. I think every coin show I've done with you, by the time we get to a presentation, sometimes items are gone. Sometimes, you know, they're so short, they're already in sellout quantities. And here's a good example of this. We like to provide quick little segments that people can view online. And then if they want, make their buying decision later. However, in the family of the gold coins, it really is important that they select them now because you don't have the same kind of inventory that you might have on other things. No, absolutely, because it's so it costs so much to put together, in essence, the gold coins. That's really what it comes down to. They don't grade very well, and so then ultimately what we end up with is literally spending millions and millions and millions and millions of dollars on gold coins is really is really where we're at on that.
Well, and I think that's important to note. So if you're interested, definitely recommend that you do it. Three pay flex pay. Remember, still unconditional money back guarantee of 30 days. Uh, we are going to continue moving really briskly through the merchandise uh, and through all the opportunities, though, because um, remember, we are getting to that encore and really for all intents and purposes, your last full airing of that this day only. Adam and Tina have that great year end special coming up at nine o'clock. And I know Mike will be making an appearance with Adam at 10 p.m., but uh, this is the last big coin show for today on a day that we look forward to coin collecting with, of course, the inimitable Mike Mizak. But as we move along, all right, Mike, we are back into Silver Eagle category. Holy moly, what are you doing here? Well, I'm going back to last year because if I'm going to sell a proof American Silver Eagle, my only choice is to go back into last year <laughs> because the United States government was supposed to normally in on today. One of our biggest sellers is the brand new proof American gold Eagle. We usually sell literally, you know, thousands of those. You know, I think we usually have two or three thousand in the first day of issue and they sell out just like that. The W mint in the first day of issue. Well, last week, the United States Mint pulled the rug right out from under us, okay, and decided that we were not going to do that, okay? That they pulled them off the schedule because they can't keep up with the demand on the regular Mint State coin. It's why they released the S-Mint Mint State coin to go with that. So there'll be no proof silver eagles that we know of for the foreseeable future, hopefully in February, maybe in March. Who knows? I mean, they'll let us know when they let us know. It's not like we have any foresight or, uh, or they have any forethought with that. But people want proof silver eagles. Well, I have a very few of the San Francisco minted proof silver eagles from last year. Now, keep in mind, <clears throat> the fact that I have them, the United States Mint is sold out of those coins. Okay? The United States Mint has sold out of those coins. So that's important for you to understand, that there are no more S-Mint coins. These are the certified coins that are Mint State, or I'm sorry, Proof 70. And what happened was, is they released the, mint, the, um, uh, the, the West Point Minted Proof American Silver Eagles very early in the year. Okay? They released those very early in the year. They sold out almost immediately. And this was like pre-COVID, too. And then once COVID hit, I mean, they're shut down the same system at the West Point. Mint. They were sold out for eight months. <clears throat> at the end of the year, they came back and, and released a few more coins. They sold out again instantly. Those are the West Point Minute coins. And then very much at the end of the year, very much at the end of the year, they did a very small mintage, 200,000 coins, which is nothing. I mean, they have special issue coins with, with higher mintages than that. They did 200,000 of the 2020 S Mint proof coins and released those. Of course, they sold out instantly. I have a few of these that I held over from last year, and I held my price. That's very important, very important, given the fact that the Mint has raised their price on all their silver coins. So the Mint's response to not being able to make enough coins was to basically take all their coin prices and raise them 30 to 50%. They said, if we can't make them, we're going to charge more for them. So what they did is they had massive price increases across the board. This is the same price we had last year. So there's no price increase in this. This is from the original issue price that we had of the Mint State or of the proof San Francisco. Don't confuse it with the West Point Mint. This was the release at the very end of the year, the rarest proof silver eagle. This is the rarest eagle that the government was going to make in 2020. And we've got it right here, right now. Well, and of course, as always, on an on-demand opportunity with with limited reservations for sure and that unconditional money back guarantee of 30 days flex pay of $74.98 and and Mike there are so many things that you do that are distinctive and different I mean I always look to see what you do with the core I always look to see what you do in terms of the overall presentation and this is another one when we talk about that silver eagle story that um that has unfolded over 2020 it's, it's amazing to me that, hey, when the government is raising their prices, not Mike Mizak, not Mike yeah. Mizak. <laughs> well, sometimes we're forced to, but in this case, we weren't, so we're not going to. Yeah. 
Absolutely. And, you know, and that's why um, I made that comment earlier about how M Mike really does curate these shows. He hand selects, he curates everything that you'll see in any coin collector show. So I think that's important that you understand he really does think of you. He thinks of you whether you're a first time customer here at HSN or a first time customer in the coin collector or you're an avid collector. And I think that's one of the reasons when we do say the family of Eagles or when we do some of those um, larger ticket items that you'll see a lot of multiple purchases because we trust Mike, we rely on Mike, we certainly rely and learn from his expertise, but this is a really terrific opportunity for you to jump in, get this and grab the last of this, I know I keep saying historic, but this momentous year for sure at $74.98, right Mike? Yeah, I think absolutely no doubt about that because it sold out from last year. I don't know when I'm going to be able to sell a silver eagle from this year. So then why not buy the rarest proof silver eagle, actually the rarest uh, regular issue silver eagle from last year from the United States government? Why not buy that? I've got a very few of these still remaining, like I said, in the San Francisco Bridge Corps, 100% exclusive to us. Well, it's, it's something I, I really, really like the opportunity on this. I have a very few of these remaining. I'm glad I saved them, and I'm glad I've been able to hold the price. Well, I think we all are. And, of course, 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Hey, um, we've only got about 40 minutes left in the show. Remember, Adam and Tina are coming up with their great big year-end countdown. And that means you will see one more presentation of that this day only with Adam. But this is the last coin show for the big day that we wait for from Mike Mizak, our king of coins here at HSN and we got a lot of things to get to before you see that encore look at our this day only so Mike with only a couple minutes on this I'm going to defer to you yeah well I, I just want to do this we're going to do because we did have we've done the annex right uh, and the TS sold out 13,500 we're going to do the great today only value with the uh, NGC flag core but look, we have lots of people who are loyal to uh, grading companies. They love the Annex, but they also collect NGC or PCGS or collect PCGS and NGC and also Annex, uh, uh, even ICG. All of those coins is what they are. So we feel obligated, I feel obligated, to make sure that everybody has an opportunity so that we kind of give the opportunity for all of the grading companies, okay, for all of the grading companies. And so with this particular coin, this is the PCGS coin. And the premier label, okay, the premier label that you see there is exclusive to me again. So this is a special premier. This is an extremely limited edition is what we've got in the PCGS coins uh, uh, to have this premier label. You can only get it, uh, like I said, through me, through my company, that with this. So we're nine, and it's the same thing with the Silver Eagle, and we've talked about it for the whole show. The United States government is changing the design. We thought they were going to do it at the beginning of the year. They're going to do it halfway through the year. So what they're going to do is release the old style, this coin, the Type 1, the Heraldic Eagle, for the first six months. The problem is, is they just can't keep up with the demand. More importantly, there's no way they can get in front of the demand for the Type 2s. So what we're doing here is giving you the chance for the premier PCGS at $99.95. And then with that comes an auto ship one coin of the type two okay the type two coin the new design also for 99 dollars and 95 cents also for 99 dollars and 95 cents is what we're looking at so you'll get this you get the first coin the type one and then you get in line you're guaranteed for the type two as well so you get like i said it's it, you make sure that you get both of the historic coins your price could never go up your delivery is guaranteed and that is something that is going to become more and more valuable more and more highly sought after as the year goes on and people realize just how crazily uh, difficult these coins are going to be to get. Well, and I will say this, and I know Suzanne said it when she launched the day, that little stinker, she got a first look at that today's special that sold out earlier, is whenever mm -hmm. we see you or the coin collector do some kind of auto ship opportunity, that is ultimately the smartest way to go. It just is for a lot of different reasons because, Mike, then, like you said, you have um, not only that umbrella of security, but it just really kind of puts you first in line and, and gives you just kind of a little level of comfort that you can really know that you're going to get what you're paying for. 
Precisely. And, and what you're getting with this is an exclusive label. You're getting an absolutely perfect coin. But more importantly, you're getting the guaranteed coins. You're getting guaranteed Type 1 2021 Certified Perfect 70 PCGS Premier Label, which is 100% exclusive to us here at HSN, all right, or to, to my company here. You also then get in the ownership a one coin and one coin only ownership, also at $99.95, the Type 2. And I cannot impress upon you enough how important it is that you have the opportunity to already be in line for the Type 2. I, I don't think people, I think about February or March, people are going to start understanding what the new design is going to mean. As the world in general, the, the people at large get a look at the brand new American Silver Eagle, everybody wants to turn the page on 2020, and why not with a brand new Silver Eagle design? So now you get the last in the line, and you also get the first in line, both of them for the very first time produced in the same year. Okay, Mike, here's what they're telling me. Um, we are going to do a quick little swap -roo here. I'm kind of getting my... Okay, so, Mike, 30 seconds. You're up. Yeah, well, it's pretty simple. They're just going to do a uh, uh, Mint State 69. There's no auto ship on this. There's a lot of people who just do Mint State 69 coins. They, uh, they collect them. The 70 is not important to them. They want the Type 1. They want PCGS. They want the Premier label. But they don't really care about 70. Not everybody. I mean, I think it's the most important determining factor of value, but that doesn't, that doesn't mean everybody does. And so we sell a lot of them in state 69 coins. And it, you save $20. It's that same American Silver Eagle. It's the Type 1. It's certified. It's PCGS. It's in the exclusive label. You put all those things together, and, yeah, it's still a fantastic way to collect the coins, but it's Min State 69. It's just one grade lower. So a lot of people putting together Min State 69 PCGS sets you are going to want this coin for that set. Uh, they are indeed. Okay, so really kind of a, a companion in a way. Uh, now we're up with another 2021 edition. Well, and like I said, we're going to continue on with this. I mean, you know, uh, we're going to give the Annex is sold out. Uh, the PCGS Premier is, uh, is you know, uh, uh, on its way to sell out. But we also have the NGC. So here's the Heraldic Eagle Type 1. $99.99. Once again, you know, this was that same, remember we had the S Mint earlier? Maybe we can flash that when we're done with this. This is the West Point Mint. We also have the Emergency Production S Mint. Those are the only two Eagles that are going to be released for the foreseeable future from the United States Mint. But this is that first one. This is that Mint State 70. It's the exclusive core that I've got, the black core with the Lady Liberty, uh, uh, with the Lady Liberty design on it. I mean, it is stunning. It is absolutely stunning. Kudos to our uh, design team for that, the folks at NGC that helped put that together. And so what you got is $99.95. $99.95. And then, of course, you're going to get the auto ship one coin, the Type 2, that we've talked about over and over and over again with the Type 2 coin that we've got within that. And that Type 2 coin that's going to be in there is also going to be $99.95, also going to be $99.95. I'm looking at this right now, and here's the thing. We have already sold well over 1,000 of these. Well, there's 13,500 in the Annex edition that's sold out, I don't have 13,000. Okay, I don't have 5,000 of these coins. You have to understand, this first coin, the first allocation of coins from the 2021 series, the Type 1 coin, they've basically already been spoken for. What we have is what we have. This was a situation that we had last year in many instances. So what you get here is not only the opportunity to get a coin relatively early in the cycle and get a coin at all, but to get it in our exclusive holder, to get it uh, in absolutely perfect Mint State 70, and as importantly, in my opinion, is you're able to lock in, 100% lock in, and get this Type 2 with that as well. I think that's as important of a situation as anything out there, is that you're going to get the Type 2 as well. Well, and I, th I think that's really important that people understand that. So uh, we are turning the page. We've got another opportunity for you kind of in this family of collectability. Channel surfers, remember, we will have an encore opportunity on that this day only, which is truly a this day 
Wednesday only in just a few moments. And Mike, for people who are just channel surfing, uh, it might be helpful because the coin we say next or will show next kind of tells this story. There, 70 is that perfect grade. So some of the parameters of things that I look for, I look for grade, I look for, tell, tell our new or novice customers some of the things that really set this apart or what to look for. Well, there's the, the, some of the things that you want to look for is, once again, you said the exclusivity, but you also want to look at, at, at the, the, the grade. The single most important determining factor of, uh, of value in coin collecting is the grade. The higher the grade, the more it's worth. And this coin is certified absolutely positively perfect. And so that is critically important. Like we just showed you the 1986 coin. I mean, the 1986 coin in Mint State 70 is an $850 coin. I mean, it's an $850 coin. In Mint State 69, it's a $129 coin, $149 coin. The difference is only the grade. The difference is only the grade. That is the only thing that is the difference between the two coins. So in this coin, you've got Mint State 70, so you have absolute perfection. And then you add in the fact that the coin itself is rare, only being made for six months out of the year instead of the whole year. That it's a Type 1, and there's also going to be a Type 2. When you buy this coin, you're locked into the type 2 coin as well you put all of that together and we're guaranteeing the price on the type 2 coin as well that's something that i think is uh, is abundantly abundantly uh, valuable to the collector absolutely so michael just we've switched out now so now we're talking about the mint state 69 for people who collect you know or they're they're looking for that <laughs> This has been funny. I, I've, I've aired this for about five minutes today, all told. The, the uh, Mint State 69 Type 1 in our brand new, it just tells me how popular this core is. People that don't necessarily want the 70. We've sold almost 1,000 of these. Wow. In Mint State 69, and I've aired it for about five or eight minutes by the time you put it all together. So what it is, is it's just a, you know, it's it's an NGC coin. It's in a black core. It's in our Liberty core, which is the only way to get that. You know, like I said, that's exclusive, 100% exclusive to my company, Type 1, Heraldic Eagle, let's say 69. So if you just want this core, if you just want this coin in one of the early releases that you're going to have right here, $79.95, save the 20 bucks. Great opportunity. Great opportunity for you to just put this coin uh, away in your collection in literally one of the most beautiful holders that the United that we have ever put together with NGC. Well, again, terrific opportunity as so many hundreds, uh, actually over a thousand of you, I believe, have taken advantage of already. $26.65 flex pay. Those are interest-free payments, of course, with our 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Also, last day where you can get that $20 off apply and buy promotion on your HSN card. So check with your service representatives for details. Well, I'm Shannon. This is HSN. It's the last coin show for the day. Adam and Tina are coming up with their year and count. Down. Mike Mizak will have one abbreviated look at that this day only in that 10 p.m. hour. We're going to have the last full presentation coming up in just a few moments. Um, actually, Mike, uh, just a quick little update. Case in point, a lot of people shop after the fact. That $25 gold eagle coin is gone, is gone. Uh, so when we say you snooze, you lose, just like that today's special selling out earlier. Mike, I always defer to you for your expertise when we're talking about that gold eagle and the silver eagle. So what's the story here? Oh, wait, well, here's... Done, yeah, what we've done is done a great little pair of these uh, that we've done. So I did the uh, 2021 silver eagle. Okay, the end of the the end of the era, if you will. I also then took the five dollar gold eagle, which we also need to remember is the end of an era. Okay, so we have the five dollar eagle, and then we have the one dollar five dollar gold eagle, and then the one dollar silver eagle. This is a match numbered set, a match numbered set. I only did a hundred and seventy six of these in first day of issue, 176 in the limited edition in first day of issue, uh, an absolutely perfect pair to be able to get this. Because this is the end of the year in both silver and gold. And I really went with, I'm not pairing up any of the other sizes of the gold. It's just the $5 gold eagle that you see right here. Because I wanted to keep it as affordable as was humanly possible uh, with this. And like I said, very, very limited at 176 on this particular uh, on this particular offer. I think we've already sold a fair number of these. It is, of course, exclusive to us here at HSN, as any and all of the Annex first day of issue coins are. 
And then uh, uh, this is I, I, I'm trying to find a way to really, I mean, you know, because not everybody out there is is the coin geek like me that understands, that intuitively knows the importance of a change of design in, in, a, in an American coin series that's been going for 35 years, particularly one of this kind of a, of a popularity and significance. This is monstrously important. Okay, this is monstrously important in terms of from a numismatic standpoint that you get this, that we're changing the design. It is literally once in a lifetime, not only for the silver, but for the gold as well. It took them 35 years to change it for the very first time. It took them 35 years. By law, they can't do it again for, in 20, for 25 years. I promise you, Shannon, with all of my heart, I will not be here in 25 years selling coins on HSN. That's an absolute positive truism right there. And so this is, becomes a once-in-a-lifetime thing where it's the end of the era. After 35 years, this, this is the end. It's done, gone, and over. I've only got about um, – I've only got – Okay, I, I was waiting with. Okay, um, I was waiting with bated breath, <laughs> as it were. We have only about a hundred of these. Uh, we will try to get Mike back. You know, it's been a learning experience for all of us. Yeah, whether you're watching or working here at HSN, uh, if there was ever any doubt that we are a live network, I think we've certainly proven that uh, on many occasions, as our guests really have stepped up to the plate to. Um, adjust to the new normal as, as it will. So we will get Mike back. I do need to let you know, though, and I know Mike was alluding to this, and, uh, and as soon as we get him back, I'll allow him to fill in some more details. When you see something like this, opportunistic to be sure, 100 available, give or take. Remember, no back order, no wait list, and ah, uh, the fates are with me. Mike Mizak, do we have you back? Yeah, we do, sorry. A <laughs> little technological glitch there. I know it's the new normal that we're all learning to adjust to. So, uh, Mike, I know we were just going to check on quantities. So, about a hundred or so, give or take. Yeah, uh, that's uh, that's I think what we're looking at. We sold sixty or seventy of those uh, in the earlier shows. The pair on this, like you said, very important. It's very significant. It's very important. You know, the, the fact that it's the end of an era for both the coins, for both the silver and the gold, and I've got them put together. It's the only pairing of silver and gold that I'm going to do in a match numbered set of 176 coins with, like I said, about 100 or so sets is all that are going to be left. The first day of issue, of course, is 100% exclusive to us here at HSN in the Annex. So what you have is not only the importance of the coin, but the pretty much extreme rarity of the pair with only 176 uh, match numbered sets for what amounts to worldwide distribution. Well, and that's that's a big deal to say the least. All right, 90 seconds, actually less than that in counting because we are moving along to, well, your last uh, full and extensive look at our This Day Only. Adam and Tina coming up with that year-end countdown and then an appearance from Mike, not a full coin show, but with Adam at 10 p.m. Grab this while we've got it available. And uh, remember, there is 12-month VIP financing. Steve, you said that was... So that makes that $49.99 on your credit card. Remember, interest-free uh, payments, rather, along with that 30-day return policy. And, Mike, I know that clock is ticking down. Anything else that you'd like to share on this before we talk about that this day only? <clears throat> no, I think that pretty much covers it. I mean, it's, it is historic at every respect. I've really never done the two-coin silver and gold set before. So, uh, you know, this, this, <clears throat> this new design changed by the United States government is causing us to do a lot of different, a lot of different designs, a lot of different pairings, a lot of different opportunities. And this is, uh, uh, this is one. That's it. Okay, well, without further ado, the fanfare of the This Day Only. If it's okay, I'm just going to flip that uh, up that way. If you are channel surfing, this is a big day for our coin collectors, new and, and avid alike, because it's an annual tradition. Mike's th today's special sold out, actually, I think at like 3 or 4 o'clock this afternoon. So, as always, for the final full sh uh, coin show on this big day for him, he manages to have a few tricks up his sleeve. And 
so Mike, if people missed out on that today's special, we really do say if you snooze, you lose. And you'll forgive me for saying this, but in in some respect, this this day only is even a little. Um, has, has a unique story to tell in terms of rarity in that it is only, just like the Today Special, only offered today. It might be a this day only price, but just understand, like unlike any other this day only, that does not mean that we, yeah, yeah the price goes up, but you were doing this for today and today only, only the reservations that we're taking for the next, you know, four and a half hours, give or take, a $43.32 flex pay. So let's tell the story. I mean, not only in terms of what it is, but how unique it is, even in terms of what you do in your regular coin shows. Yeah, well, here, here's what it, we ultimately come down to, okay, on this and, and what makes this so collectible, so desirable. The United States government in November of 2019 announced that they were going to change the design of the American Silver Eagle. Everybody, including the Mint, uh, throughout 2020 was working on the supposition that that design change would come at the beginning of 2021. And they finally released the design, what it was. It was an eagle in flight. They're getting rid of this heraldic eagle design that you see right here and going with the eagle in flight. They're going to do some slight changes on the front as well. It's anti-counterfeit technology and so on and so forth. That's the new design that they're looking at doing. But 2020 being what it is, Okay, 2020 being uh, uh, 2020, you know, blew a hole in the in the plan. And so because of that, the San Francisco men had to shut down for weeks. The West Point men had to shut down for a while. The, the uh, Philadelphia men had to work with very much reduced staff throughout the entire year. And so because of that, the Mint simply could not keep up with demand. And there was no possible way that they could get brand new American Silver Eagles to be released, to get the dyes, to get everything else put together, to be able to release those at the beginning of 2021. So finally, they kind of said, uh, okay, well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to release the old design for the first six months of the year. And then in July, approximately of next year, we're going to release the Type 2, the new design. So the Eagle in Flight. So we have the Heraldic Eagle Type 1. They have the Eagle in Flight Type 2 is what you're looking at there. So they're going to do that. Now, here's the problem with that, is the United States government, if they were just producing the Type 2, just the one type, the new coin, there's no possible way they could keep up with the demand because this coin is going to be by far and away. I mean, it's not even going to be close to the most popular silver eagle ever, ever produced by the United States government. But instead, they produced another coin that's going to be probably the second most popular coin, which is the type one for the first six months. So they're producing two coins that are going to be two, three, four, five times more popular than any Silver Eagle in the history of the United States Mint. And after having done that, doing two coins instead of one, they then reduced the mintage or production time on these by half. The end result is, is there absolutely positively is not going to be enough coins of either variety. I don't think there's any doubt about that. We're already starting to see uh, uh, the, the backups in this type ones, let alone because uh, that's going to pale in comparison to what's going to happen with the type twos. So that's the situation for the most unique year in American numismatic history. They changed the design for the first time in 35 years. By law, they can't change it for another 25 years. So once in a lifetime opportunity, once in a lifetime opportunity. And then so then we took this for this this day only, took the coin and put it in our flag core. Flag core is 100 percent unique to me. Okay, flag core is unique to me. I'm the only one that can have that. I'm exclusive on flag core. I'm the only person that can sell flag core. I'm the only person that does sell flag core. So we've got that. But then we did, uh, it took it to an entirely different level. We did this happy new year version as everybody's ready to turn the page on 2020. And we are only selling this. So the addition on this, people say, how many are making? What's the addition? We are only selling the addition is whatever we sell today. This coin is available for one day, one day and one day only, this day only for this price. Additionally, when you get this on this day, 
you are also going to be eligible, not only eligible, signed up to get an auto ship of a single coin that is going to be the Type 2 coin that is going to be the most highly desirable Silver Eagle in the history of the United States Mint and is also going to be $129.95. It's also going to be in flag core. It will also be New Year's Eve edition, New Year's edition, simply because you bought it on New Year's for the first and only time a two-coin set for the year to honor the United States Mint doing two coins in a single year. Well, it's, it's, it's historic for so many reasons. Remember, you get that $43.32 flex pay on that uh, initial and first shipment. You do get that 30-day uh, unconditional money-back guarantee. And, Steve, what is the latest count? Are we over 14 or 1,500 of these? Oh, wow. I'm way off, Mike. <laughs> almost 2,000. Almost 2, over 1,800 of those spoken for. And remember, it's not like a show or a coin or any other this day only. We can say... Hey, don't worry. Yes, you can shop after the fact. Yes, we'll raise the price, et cetera, et cetera. This is truly for this day only, with only one more chance, abbreviated or otherwise, coming up with Adam and Tina. Uh, Adam in that 10 o'clock hour with the year end countdown with the dynamic duo. But, Mike, it is really important that people understand this is something that you did basically as a, a thank you and an apology and a courtesy to our friends who watch in the evening and may have missed out on that today's special. That's exactly right. And so what we have, and you have to understand in terms of the addition, so we're almost 2,000. Let me put that into perspective. The TS was 13,500. It's long gone. Okay, it is long gone at 13,500 coins. So this, is it going to be rare? Absolutely. I mean, we're not going to sell 13,500 coins in the next 10 minutes and then uh, a little bit in the 10 p.m. hour. So it's going to be significantly rarer than the Annex coin. It's going to be, how many is it going to be? It might be ending up about three or 4,000, which is a coin of this significance is nothing. Yet they're saying there's going to be millions, there's going to be tens of millions of people that are going to be scrambling for this coin. You're going to want coins that are of the highest grade, that are of the highest and most exclusive club. And that's what you have here. And of all the coins we've done, like I said, that NGC uh, uh, black core with the, uh, with the Lady Liberty in it, that's absolutely beautiful. But in terms of pure popularity, it's pretty hard to beat flag core. You know, it's pretty hard to beat flag core uh, because, I mean, you know, that appeals absolutely positively to everybody in an American Eagle coin. And, of course, flag core at 100 percent exclusive with me. So I've got the beautiful flag core coin that we've got here. I've got the New Year's edition on this that is, of course, exclusive to HSN right here, right now. So, in other words, today, only for basically the next two hours, however many we've sold and how many we will sell in about the next two hours is what the addition is going to be. That's it. No more, not a single additional coin is going to be done. So why not ring out 2020, ring in 2021 with one of the most incredible coin opportunities that we've ever had? This once-in-a-lifetime change of design by the United States Mint. They're doing both coins in a single year. They're doing both coins in a single year. They've never done that before. They've never changed the design before. With one phone call, you can get both of them. You can lock in not only the price at one twenty nine ninety five for both coins, but here's the best part. You lock in the fact that you get the coins, period. Okay? And, and understand that line, particularly for that Type 2, is going to get longer and longer and longer and longer. Look, the United States Mint has already has already taken the uh, proof American Eagle off the schedule for the for next week. Hopefully, they'll put it out in February. Who knows what they're going to be able to do with that? Because they simply can't keep up with the demand for the for this year for the first six months. That new design is only going to be made for six months. That's not enough. If they could make it for sixteen months, it wouldn't be enough. So you've got to get in line on this particular coin right now, and that's what you do. With a single solitary phone call, you get the Type 1 and you get the Type 2 absolutely guaranteed in terms of delivery and guaranteed in price. That's how important this opportunity is, and you need to 100% jump on this. Well, and all you have to do is call the phone, call the number at the bottom of your screen. It's not like you have to know somebody who's in the know. I mean, I guess you could say that you do because uh, you're shopping with a coin collector and Mike Mizak, but to make a poor analogy, it's almost as if somebody allows you 
cut in line might not be the appropriate phrasing, but I think you get where I'm going with this. You're going behind that yeah. velvet rope. You're getting that first uh, inaugural jump or leap ahead or or special access that's a good way to describe it from my from the producing booth and Steve and you know and I do think that's important because um, I think of the things that I've missed out on in life or otherwise and you you have to be in the right place at the right time I think I'm not alone when I say things in life are guided even the crazy stuff that we went through in this last year and this is really one of those guided moments and one of those guided opportunities on a collectible that has such a rare occurrence and rare story unique to us but unique in history as well and that's to Mike's point if you're going to do it though it is absolutely essential that you uh, you choose it now certainly we always recommend that you can shop seven days a week 24 hours a day here at HSN that is not something we can say about this coin because with an abbreviated look coming up at 10 p.m. with Adam in their year-end countdown that will be for for 2020 that will be your final look regardless the reservation list that special access to this coin and that type 2 ends at midnight so even if you utilize our 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee at least you have the wherewithal and the comfort and the benefit of knowing that you have this that you have secured that special access and that reservation and i think all of those things that we were talking about mike are key with this uh, this is just in every way it checks all the boxes in terms of being a great ground floor opportunity certainly a great opportunity if people are looking at getting more than one and then maybe most importantly, knowing that they have that assurance of kind of that preferential or that um, special access to that type two coin is just as important as what they're selecting today, isn't it? Yeah, that's the, the VIP premier access is what we're looking for uh, for the type two coin. And I think the thing to also keep in mind, look, we have the exclusive core flag core, which is ridiculously popular. I've got the New Year's edition, which is only here, only today, only right now. So, I mean, you know, that's exclusivity from a grading standpoint, the fact that it is mid state 70. But let's not really overlook. Let's take, you know, let's take full advantage and understand from a broader lens, if you will, just how how important this coin is in the entire Silver Eagle series. Now, we're not talking about right now. Let's broaden the, broaden the range. Let's look, take big, broad brush strokes here and see what we're looking at in terms of the American Silver Eagle. Look, President Ronald Reagan signed the Liberty Coin Act into law in 1985. And when he did, and the first the Silver Eagle was put into uh, uh, was put into production in 1986, it looked exactly like this, and they've all looked exactly like this since 1986. Every single solitary one of them. So last year, in well, actually, yeah, it's almost exactly last year, November 2019, the United States Mint says we're going to change the design in 2021. Now, the working uh, the working assumption was that they were going to change it like tomorrow was going to be the brand new uh, was going to be the brand new design, but because of the events of 2020, that simply wasn't possible uh, because of, of all the things that happened to the United States Mint. What that has created, fortunately or unfortunately, blessing or curse, you've got to look at it that way, is the fact that we now have a unique numismatic release. The fact that they are doing both of the designs in a single year. And that creates an amazing collectible opportunity specifically because either one of the coins, being the last coin of the first coin, would be the most popular, among the most popular, if not the most popular Silver Eagles ever done by the United States. The Type 2 absolutely will be far and, far and beyond the, the most popular coin ever made by the United States Mint. But they're not going to be able to make enough because they can't make it for the whole year. They were behind in 2020 when we thought that was the last coin that they were going to make, let alone now they can only make it for six months for the Type 1, six months for the Type 2. The six months for the Type 1, they're going to be hobby behind on a regular basis. Type 2 for six months, it's going to be catastrophic in terms of distribution. I mean, yeah, there's just no, there's, there's going to be millions of people, uh, multitudes of millions of people that simply may not be able to get the coin, let alone get the coin in an exclusive flag core holder, in a one-day-only sale, in an extremely limited edition. As we're looking at it right now, the edition's about 2,500. We're looking at an edition of maybe about 3,000 coins for the entire year because only what we sell today is the edition. It shuts off in essence. 
contestants at midnight. We're looking at 2,200 coins right now. Now we have a few minutes left. We got a couple hundred people on the phone. But the fact of the matter is, is what this is is a fantastic fantastic opportunity for you to own a unique numismatic coin that is presented and collectible in an absolutely positively unique way. Nobody has ever done this sold only for eight hours thing before. In the past, we've done a New Year's Eve edition of a single solitary coin. But we sold it for the entire year. We waited uh, until over half the day was gone to even release this. And then we're doing the flag court, and we're doing New Year's Eve edition, and and there's an auto ship. We've never done an auto ship component, only one coin, obviously, the Type 2, and we'll never do it again. We'll never do it again because this will never happen again, at least that I'll be around for it, because by law they can't change the design for another 25 years. So that's what we're working with. That's the working plan, the working uh, collectible plan that we have here is the most unique collection, two-coin collection of the American Silver Eagle that will ever be done, period, end of story. That's it, okay? And you have it in basically the most unique holder that I've ever been able to design. The flag core is certainly exclusive to me, but then that one-day-only, eight-hour sale only of the New Year's edition as well. All of those factors today, I think, has created this perfect, absolutely positively perfect collectible. Now, remember, not only do you get the Type 1 when you buy this, you also guaranteed to get the Type 2 at the same exact price. Now, understand, if you don't want it, that's fine. Well, you can cancel that. The obligation is ours. The opportunity is yours. After you get it, you can return it. If you don't want the Type 2, that's fine. You can cancel. Understand the obligation is for me to send it to you if you want it, but I think that's one of the most important parts of this is not only do you get this uh, a Type 1, but you also get guaranteed that Type 2 coin. Well, and I think that's key. I think it's instrumental. Not only that you're securing that this day only price, but you have that special access guaranteed. And remember, that is only for the next now, only three hours, because I see Tina and Adam in the wings are getting ready uh, for that big grand finale event for 2020 on HSN. Take this moment, though, and select this now while we are still taking your reservation for special access, that special this day only pricing, and of course, that exclusivity that cannot be underestimated as well, all with our 30 day return policy and that flex pay of $43.32. Mike, in the final moments, uh, anything else that you'd like to, to remind people about? I'm just telling you, this is a unique opportunity. Do not sit on the sidelines. Take advantage. If you've ever thought about collecting coins, this is the place to start. Uniqueness on a level we've never been able to offer and a unique coin that we'll never see again. Absolutely well said, that we will never see again. Uh, boy, that summarizes it. Mike, I know you'll be back in the 10 o'clock hour with just an encore look at the This Day Only. Thank you, my blessings, my love to you. Best of to all of us in 2021, okay? Yeah, thank you, Shannon. Good to see you as always. Well, I will hopefully see you in the house tomorrow night at 7 p.m., our first show of the new year. Looking forward uh, to spending some time with you as well. Stick around. Uh, Tina and Adam are coming up next. That big countdown to whew, breathe a sigh of relief. The new year. Thanks for shopping, everybody. I'll see you next year tomorrow at 7. The new year is here, and it's time to refresh, revive, and replenish. Discover new products, programs, and special events that inspire you to do, wear, and create what you love. It's your time to create the life you love every day with the help of HSN. It's the return of celebrity chef Ann Burrell, and she's bringing the tools and tips you'll need to cook like a rock star. Don't miss Chef Ann Burrell, premiering Wednesday on HSN and at hsn.com. You can't afford not to be brave. It's not even an option. When life puts a wall in front of you, you break it down. Remove the fear. Remove the uncertainty. Be authentic. They say fortune favors the bold. I've been bold all my life, and I don't plan on stopping anytime soon.
love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search Gemstone to see our Gemstone Enhancement Chart. Well, good evening, everybody. The countdown has begun. The countdown to midnight and the countdown to a brand new year. My name's Adam Freeman, and my, of course, amazing co-host is Tina Jennings. Wait. Wait. Oh. You, I thought we were doing, like, you know, at home, what? New Year's pajamas. You PJs? Was this not what we were doing tonight? Well, they um, said be, like, casual. I, 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 I mean, casual. My like, PJs has He-Man and the 